Look there. Grab it. Run fast. We use our eyes to see. We use our hands to grab things, and we use our legs to run. Let's learn about the face and body parts: head, shoulders, knees. Which part of the body comes next, Lingo Kids? We bet you'll remember after we sing and dance along to one of our favorite songs about body parts. Head and shoulders, head, head and shoulders. 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 Head, head, shoulders. head, head, shoulders. head shoulders, knees and toes. Eyes, ears, mouth and nose. Head, shoulders, knees and toes. Around and around we go. Head and shoulders, head, head and shoulders. Head and shoulders, head, head and shoulders. Shoulders, knees and toes. Eyes, ears, mouth, and nose. Shoulders, knees, and toes. Around and around we go. Head and shoulders, head, head and shoulders. 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 Knees and toes. Eyes, ears, mouth, and nose. Knees and toes. Around and around we go. Head and shoulders, head, head and shoulders. Head and shoulders, head, head and shoulders. And toes, eyes, ears, mouth and nose. And toes, around and around we go. Eyes, ears, mouth and nose. Around and around we go. Head and shoulders, head, head and shoulders. 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 Head, and shoulders, head, head and shoulders. Head, shoulders, knees and toes. Around and around we go. Now that we're all warmed up, let's talk about some different body parts. Head, ears, neck, arm, shoulder, Hand, finger, chest, stomach, leg, knee, foot. Let's practice these new words with our Lingo Kids friends. Touch your head. Touch your legs. Touch your arms. Clap your hands. Touch your head. Touch your legs. Touch your arms. Clap your hands. The doll is on the shelf. She needs some body parts. Let's help her. Finger, leg, arm, foot.
hand. Head. Great job. Select your favorite character. Elliot! Welcome to the big race. Answer the questions correctly to win. Three, two, one, go! How many fingers do you see? Seven. Well done! Ooh, the race is very close! Count the number of fingers! One! Amazing! You're in first place! How many fingers do you see? Three! Well done! How many fingers do you see? Ten! Good job! How many fingers do you see? Nine! Incredible! Count the number of fingers! Two! Amazing! Count the number of fingers! Seven! Well done! How many fingers do you see? Well done! Count the number of fingers! One! Incredible! How many fingers do you see? Nine! Good job! Help Lisa find all the secrets about the heart. Find all the secrets in the maze to unlock the magic door. Uh. Who turned off the lights? Good thing we have a light. You found a secret! Join the pieces! Your heart pumps blood 24 hours a day. You found a secret! Join the pieces! Your heart is in the middle left side of your chest. You found a secret! Join the pieces! All animals and insects have a heart. You unlocked the door! <laughs> Your heart pumps blood 24 hours a day. Your heart is in the middle left side of your chest. All animals and insects have a heart.
body 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 pick the body parts head arm arm leg 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 color the body yellow blue purple tap the arrow time to energize head arms legs make the robot dance Our hands have fingers. Our feet have toes. Show us how you can trace the hand and the foot in these traceables. Foot. It's a foot. Hand. It's a hand. Come on, Lingo Kids. Let's see how well you remember all the new words you've learned about the body. Let's play memory cards and learn about body parts. Tap a card. Arm. Leg. Head. Hand. Head. Arm Arm Hand Leg Hand Leg Leg Let's play again Hand Arm, foot, arm, hand, hand, foot, leg, leg, foot, foot. Congratulations! Did you know that the face also has many different parts to it? It's true. Take a look. Eyes. Nose. Chin. Forehead. Cheek, eyebrow, ear, mouth.
mouth, teeth, tongue. Some animals, like bears, have big eyes, big wet noses, and large teeth. Eyes and ears open, Lingo Kids. Listen closely to what Teacher Meredith has to say about the parts of the face. Hi, Lingo Kids. It's Meredith, your English teacher. This week in Lingo Kids, we're learning about the face. This is my nose. Ooh. These. These are my ears. <laughs> Those aren't my ears. These are my eyes. And this, this is my mouth. Have fun learning about the face this week in Lingo Kids. Bye bye. The Lingo Kids characters want to learn more about the face with you. Let's go. Look, it's a face. But it's missing the parts. Can you help us? Ears, eyes, a nose, teeth, hair, a mouth. Wee! Great job! Eye. It's an eye. Ooh. It's a mouth. Raise your hand if you love to paint your face. Teacher Paul and Teacher Lonnie love face painting too. Hi, Lingo Kids. I'm your teacher, Paul. Today, I'm going to use some paint to learn about the parts of my face. Okay. First, I'm going to paint my eyes. I. Eyes. Okay, now I'm going to paint my ears. Ear. Ear. Ears. What should I paint now? <coughs> right, my nose. Nose. And now I'm going to paint around my mouth. M mouth. Hi. Hi, Lonnie. Hi, Paul. What are you doing? I was just using some paint to learn about the parts of my face. I, I see. You painted your eyes, <laughs> your nose, your mouth, <laughs> and even your ears. <laughs> Let's clean you up. Hey, that tickles. <laughs> Goodbye, Goodbye, Lingo, Lingo kids. kids. <laughs> we all know how important it is to keep ourselves healthy and clean like when we sneeze into a tissue or wash our hands. Let's learn about these healthy habits with our curiosity coach. Sneezing. Hi, Lingo Kids. I'm Libby, your curiosity coach. Hi, Lisa. Hi, my nose tickles. Huh? 
<laughs> wow, that was a big sneeze. <laughs> Everyone sneezes in their own way. Yeah, I know all about it. Really? Uh, no. What is a sneeze? Hmm. Let's find out. A sneeze is a nose cleaner. If your nose tickles, that means there's something in there that your body doesn't like. Your brain says, time to sneeze, and you get it out. You might sneeze because you have allergies. Allergies? Allergies are things that make some people sneeze, but not everyone. Maybe we're allergic to dust. Oops. Hmm. Dust is all over our homes. It gets in the air and then in your nose. Can you help find any dust in your home? You can help clean it up. It's fun. Pollen can make you sneeze too. Pollen is in flowers and trees. And bees eat it. Buzz. If you look really closely, you can see pollen in the center of a flower. Uh-oh, you got pollen in your nose. Well, my nose didn't touch the flower. Pollen is in the air. You breathe it into your nose. Some people have allergies to cats and dogs. Oh no! Oh yes. Sometimes you sneeze because you're sick. But guess what? Sneezing helps get the germs out of your nose. Those germs really fly! You don't want to get your germs on anyone else. Use a tissue to cover your nose and mouth when you sneeze. Like this. <laughs> If you don't have a tissue, sneeze into your upper arm. That way you catch the sneeze and all its germs. Remember to wash your hands after you sneeze. Yeah! And your upper arm if you sneeze there to clean off any germs. Why else do we sneeze? Sometimes you sneeze when you walk into bright sunlight. <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes you sneeze when you smell pepper. Really? <sighs> it sounds silly, but it happens. Our bodies are amazing. They know just what to do. I'm curious. What other amazing things does your body do? Think about it. <laughs> See you next time for more curiosity time. It's time to make some bubbles. That's right, we're washing our hands all together now. Hand washing time. First, wet the hands with warm water. Water! Now wash them with soap. to scrub the hands. Scrub! Now rinse off the soap. Rinse! Time to dry off. You did it! 
Yay! <laughs> Job, Lingo Kids. We have just one more song to dance to. Get up on your feet. It's time to move our bodies with Baby Bot and the Lingo Kids friends. Bye. 
That's all for today, Lingo Kids. We'll see you next week on our channel for an all new topic of the week. Subscribe! Get the Lingo Kids app! <laughs> see you in Lingo Kids!